Come on along and listen to The Lullaby of Broadway The Hip Hooray and Ballyhoo Lullaby of Broadway Manhattan babies don't sleep tight Listen to the lullaby of old Well, I could tell you that we're pumping out more neon than we've ever historically done in the past. And I, I think there are a number of reasons for that. I think definitely one of the reasons might be that fewer and fewer, fewer people are making neon these days, though there's still a tremendous amount in, in our closed society, so to speak. But a lot of people have given up. A lot of people who like sign shops no longer have neon shops because they're using LEDs, as, as you know, for work, which doesn't affect us and has never affected us because the type of signs that LEDs are used on are really larger scale exterior signs, which is not what we do. We do more of a niche product, more of a, a specialty, high-end, one-of-a-kind product, as opposed to like, you know, Olive Garden or something like that, where they might be using LEDs inside their signs for illumination purposes where you don't actually see the product, you just see the reflective light from it. And that's not what we do. Okay, I have, I have four units I'm working on here. Three of them are gonna be repairs. You can see are broken. I'm gonna have to splice new pieces in. And one of them is a remake. I have to make completely over, so I'm gonna start with that one. I'm gonna start with the letter B. So first thing I do is I measure out with my glass so I know where to make my first bend. I'm going to heat about two and a half, three inches of glass. We have two kinds of fires we work with. One is a crossfire for making small bends, our right angles, double backs. But this one I'm going to do in what we call the ribbon burner, which is an adjustable fire. You adjust it according to how much glass you want to heat. Now the glass is just starting to get hot. Want to heat it up a little more till it starts to get a little soupy. I have to keep turning the glass to fight gravity. Gravity wants to pull it down. I come out, blow a little, lay it on the pattern. This bend is going to be a 90 degree bend, so this one I'm going to do in the crossfire. You see the glass is starting to move, gets a little orange in color. I come out, make my bend, and lay it on the pattern. And then we backfill it with the gas, either argon or neon. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's funny. There used to be uh, a lot of competition in the neighborhood, but it's, it's pretty much all gone. We're one of the last ones left. <laughs> kind of a dying art. So now I'm going to take the units, place them on the, what we call the aging table, and bring them up to full brightness. Okay, now I'll turn it on. And that's it. You can see the neon comes up uh, pretty quick. A little blue there that'll have to come in a little more orange. And then that's it. They'll take them downstairs, paint the units out, and they're done. Back in the day, I mean, back in the 30s and 40s, it was actually a big deal to have a neon sign in your store. And if you got a neon sign in your store, supposedly it would attract business. You know, there's a couple of movies. Uh, there's uh, The Best Years of Our Life, which uh, is a famous movie made right after World War II. There's a bar owner and he says, hey, I just got a new neon sign. And the guys come in after the war was over and they, hey, you got a new neon sign. Congratulations. That was a kind of a big thing back in the 40s. Now it's just everywhere. You know, and now it just seems to be hitting the top of the bubble and maybe starting to go a little, little down as far as popularity with the LEDs coming into effect and everything. Now with the advent of LEDs, that's taking a lot away from uh, neon. Times Square used to have thousands and thousands and thousands of feet of neon. Today it's all been replaced with jumbotrons. So, you know, LED is a nice light. It's got its purposes. It's got its, you know, certain niches in the sign industry. But to me, nothing will replace neon. Sleep tight, 
let's call it a Lullaby of old Broadway They say the neon lights are bright 